Hi there, welcome back to Tavern Tales coverage of the Virginia Craft Brewers Festival. We're here at Devil's Back in the base camp facility. Lisa, she is the co-owner of Blue and Gray Brewing in Fraser, Virginia. Lisa, thank you. Thank you. Appreciate it. So, first question, how did you guys decide to set it up in Fredericksburg? Um, just because of the history of the space is for uh, Jeff, the majority owner, actually was from the area. Um, he got tired of working at the desk job 24-7 and went ahead and decided, you know what, I like beer. No prefer. And well, Fredericksburg seemed to be the best spot. And did he have any prior, did you have any prior brewing experience before that? Or was it kind um, of a He did. Like um, we have not. We actually got our brewing experience from Blue and Gray. Um, so, all learning curve. And uh, do you, how do you, who's the head brewer? Uh, right now it's Aaron. Um, he has been there for about six months now. We've had a couple of turnovers in the last about 12 months, um, but he's actually perfected a lot of good, good, good beers. Okay, how long have you Since 2001. Okay, so they've been around for a bit over a decade, so keeping that, keeping the various brewery population Absolutely. Uh, helping out with the beer. So, you know, why the specific, because I've been to the brewery population. Why that location in the city? Why not more centered in downtown? Um, sometimes with the downtown stuff, the market is very high as far as the rent goes, and uh, they're actually still working on the zoning issues. So right now, the only place you can put a hold of manufacturing here is in the industrial area, which puts us out where we are. So actually, if you look in Fredericksburg, there are places that serve beer, but nobody else can manufacture beer in the downtown area as of right now. Okay, so that's just a Virginia coding yeah, thing? Yeah, well, it's the uh, city of Fredericksburg, and then you also have County of Stafford. There's so many zoning issues, that's where you can actually manufacture beer. Okay. And, uh, and, and as we we're saying off camera, I've actually I'm from Fredericksburg originally, and I've had every beer you all make. Um, so, so I've had quite a bit. But what's something that you know really separates all apart as far as the beer? I'm gonna say probably the fact that a lot of the uh, a lot of the brews that we actually do a lot of the grain comes from local farms here in the Fredericksburg other of the region. So we don't try and get to reach out to the, the West Coast or you know Canada or anything else. We try to stick with our local products. And a lot of our beers, um, or all of our beers actually, all of the flavor comes from purely from grain. There's no additives. There's no fruit. There's no flavoring. Everything is grain based flavor. So we're we're more of a natural kind of. Beer. And uh, if you don't mind me asking, out of all the beer you all make, what's your favorite? My favorite is the Classic Lager. Classic Lager, all right. Well, very good. Again, thank you for watching Tap Room Tales. Again, this is Lisa from uh, Blue and Gray Brewing. Lisa, thank you very thank much. Thank you. Appreciate it.